Ronnell Nolan, President, CEO, Health Agents for America, coming to you live this Monday. I hope you had a wonderful Thanksgiving. Very crazy and busy for me last week. My mom, she's 77 years old, wanted to go on a cruise during Thanksgiving. Open enrollment doesn't get open enrollment. Um, I had a tooth pull right before I left, which was I'm going to say a struggle while I was on the cruise. She fell, um, ended up in a wheelchair. We're going to find out really what um, that damage is at the doctor later. So still worked, still brought files. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed it a little bit more than I did because it was a huge struggle. I wanted to point y'all to a very important article that came out, I believe, on Thanksgiving um, from Insurance Newsnet, Susan uh, Root. It will hopefully explain exactly how important and ha how important you guys are to me and how passionate I am about our industry. Proposed rules were released about a week ago, the middle of open enrollment for Medicare and um, for, you know, ACA. And what it says might not apply to everybody, but what you should pay attention to is the fact that it's one more thing that's directed to our industry. What this 480 pages, part of it says, is the marketing deduct a marketing dollars that insurance companies give to GAs, FMOs, big agencies through the Medicare programs to promote their products, to hold educational um, conferences, to help the everyday agent that works with one of those programs get the information that they need for Medicare Advantage plans. It wants to stop that. They basically uh, have a bullseye on Medicare Advantage period. What I will say is, and uh, what I was interviewed two times uh, before I left for the cruise, and in both I told a story that I brought my mom to the eye doctor and I talked to these two very prominent ladies. You could tell they were not low income, they were very prominent. They were best friends, they had both picked um, Medicare Advantage plans. Different plans, love them. All these committee hearings that they're having and CMS is doing all this attacking on Medicare Advantage, but they're not bringing in the seniors. They're not talking to the seniors to find out exactly, do they like them? Why did they choose them? And what I've said in every um, interview and was definitely repeated in the article by Susan Roop was turn off these TV commercials. You wanna stop confusing um, seniors? Leave agents alone, we're doing our job. Turn the TV commercials off. Stop Joe, Ma D Joe Namath, stop these, you know, Jerry Jeff Walker, whoever these folks are that are talking these seniors into changing plans. Stop that. When you stop that, then everything else will fall in line. But just know that I am working as hard as I can. Um, I am flying up to Washington on the 5th or the 6th, I think the 6th, um, to meet with CMS, to just talk about, you know, things that are affecting our industry and why is it affecting our industry and why are we constantly under their spotlight and how do we get out of their spotlight and how can we get them to leave us alone and how can they just let us do our job we're responsible for, I'm gonna guess and say, at least 70%. It's up there of all Medicare and ACA enrollments. You guys are doing your job. You are excellent. You are rock stars. You do not need anybody's thumb being put on your head holding you down. It's gonna be a short open, uh, short open enrollment. No, it's not. Well, it is almost over. It's gonna be a short Monday morning news. Um, but just know that I love you. If you need me, please reach out. Um, I'm here.
I am absolutely here. I'm going to be working as hard as you guys 24 7, seven days a week until open enrollment and absolutely through the end of the year into January 15th. So, Ronnell Nolan, proud and honored to represent the Hoffa Freedom Fighters, the cream of the crop, the best of the best. Until next Monday, have a great day.